This all started with a call from a nine-year-old boy who was inside the home behind me. He called a relative who then called police. She told police that there was a man inside the house who was trying to commit suicide and he was injured. When police arrived, they found four bodies inside the home. Two adult women and a young a girl and then an adult male. Now they say, police say there were obvious signs of trauma. They wouldn't elaborate on how these uh, four were killed, but they do say that the scene is still active and there's plenty of uh, evidence to sift through at this time. Now. And they have not released the identities of those victims just yet, and they're still trying to gather the details of what's happening. Now, obviously, a very scary situation for neighbors on this quiet block, and police wanted to make sure they expressed their deepest condolences to the victims and their families. This is a type of call any police officer, fireman, or paramedic dreads to get, especially during the holiday season. This is a tragic event that has affected us all, and which will have a huge impact and this tight-knit community here in the city of Crowley. And what you're seeing now, this is family and friends just across the street holding hands and praying. They are still out here. Um, as I speak, along with investigators and police, they say they'll be out here throughout the night trying to gather details. What we do know is that the home right behind me, four bodies were found, one young girl and three adults.